have flown. I have sailed. I have moved about this world of ours. And ever in search of the finest of its kind, we bring you the top in pine chillers. <laughs> The creaking door. The manufacturers of State Express 35 Silver King cigarettes take pleasure in presenting The Creaking Door. taste of new smooth State Express 3.5s today. We promise you, it's the smoothest cigarette you can get. It's a blend that has been perfected after years of constant research by our master blenders and the recent development of an entirely new process which gives you an even smoother 3.5 smoke. We promise you, it's the smoothest cigarette you can get. Move in world class. Get the taste of new, smooth, State Express 35 today. It must have been beautiful a couple of hundred years ago. Look as if that mine shut down altogether. That's funny. Mind if I have a look at this place? The deserted coal mine? Well, it's too much. It won't take us long. If it did run out, it would be rather interesting, wouldn't it? Well, to you, I suppose. Come along. You don't have to be intelligent, but uh, you have to be interested. <laughs> Many of the early coal mines in Wales were open cast working. Those that weren't, such as this one, never went down particularly deep. There was a hand ladder down the side of the pit shaft. Anne wasn't too keen, so she stayed on the surface while I descended the ladder. There were three levels, and I reached the deepest one quite easily. <coughs> that must be easier way. Now, the torch. sound of death about them. I admit I didn't stop to find out. I scrambled back up that ladder in double quick time. Anne was waiting impatiently for me on the surface. (laughs) A 
Well, let's get out of here. What's the matter? You look as if you've seen a ghost. I didn't see anything, but I heard enough. Come on, let's get back to the car. I need a drink. <laughs> That would have been the old fellow, my nice boy. Didn't close down his last couple of years. Why did they close it down? Because the men refused to work there, that's why. After they brought up those bodies. What bodies? Oh, well, there was a cave in, you know. I was only a lad at the time, but I remember it well. Three men were trapped. Took him two days to dig them out. When they did, two of them were dead. Horribly dead. And the third, well, he didn't more or less out of his mind ever since. The stain of any captain? Well, that plus the fact that they were breathing bad air, I suppose. Could damage the brain. Wasn't that at all? Oh, you was the third man. He's sitting over there. What? Why don't you have a word with you? I like to think, Mr. Oh, they called me you. I never find the beer just now, Frank. Who's he at the moment? So this is my wife, Anne. Uh, you would like to um, have a word with you, if you don't mind. Oh, I don't mind. <laughs> what about? What do you want to talk about? It doesn't sound like. My friend, I don't mind either. But I don't suppose you can see them. Your friends sitting there next to me. They won't bother you, though, as me. They're interested in making sure I don't talk too much. Uh, talk about what? Oh, it doesn't matter. <laughs> so what do you want to talk about, then? Uh, the mine, the well in mine. Oh, the mine. The barman says that you were the only survivor of a disaster there. A cave in, that's right. Only I didn't survive, really. Not really. I'm, um, I'm a geologist. I'm very interested in that old mine. Looks to me as if there's still plenty of coal down there. Oh, plenty. Tons and tons and tons of it. Plenty, boy. So why is no one worth it anymore? Can't get nobody to go down here. Not after the sacrifice. I was lucky. I might have been sacrificed. I don't understand. Mm. Sacrifice? Who would have sacrificed you? The druid. The druid down there in the mine. They would have done it. I looked at the old man. He was smiling at me, but the look on his face was far from mad. But he didn't expect me to believe what he said. I considered the possibility that he was having a joke at the stranger's expense. I'd heard of the Druids, of course. The ancient Celtic people had inhabited that part of the world before the Romans landed in 66 BC. An ancient cult. Their secrets lost in antiquity. But I did remember that they were known to have had temples where they carried out human sacrifices, like Stonehenge, for instance. I prodded you with a promised drink, and he started on his story. There was me, Owen Williams, and Elise David. Just the three of us. Oh, for a long time before that, we'd been bothered with strange things happening in that mine. Everyone was on edge, like, well, what sort of thing? Well, there was the time the pit train ran itself. Pit train? Do you have trains down there? Oh, used to have. Strings of trucks filled with the coal and pulled by ponies in those days. Never saw the light of day, some of them ponies. Born down there. Died down there. This one, you know. Oh, so long ago now, it seems like another life. We were walking along number three level. Seen in a bit. When we heard the train come in. like a butt out of darkness. A man stood. A man. A ghost. I don't want to say. And he was lashing with a long branch, like a whip. 
Had he been some sort of a chariot? You never know what. Just those little big ponies. Captain of this. I just the devil himself were behind them. Their eyes white with terror. And it was quite impossible that little things like that could pull that number of trucks at that speed. But they did. They did. They galloped. Trying to get away from the thing to which they were harmed. That first truck with that mad savage standing on it. And he was laughing. Laughing and screaming and whipping at the ponies. And he wasn't really there at all. I knew that. But who would believe us? He decided to say nothing about it. Pity, because if we had well, maybe Owen and Elise would be alive today. They were the ones who were trapped with you? That's right. What well, wasn't just that train. Other things happened. The cage dropped two levels. Lucky there was no one inside it. And then came that day. Owen and Elise and me, far we were good pals, we used to sing in the choir together. Oh, fine tenor old Owen. Hope he gets a chance to sing wherever he's gone. But she didn't sing that day. He screamed. We all screamed in terror. We were working in number five working. A new face hadn't been worked long, just the three of us. Owen and me working with the pick. And the knees shoveling into the truck. Then I slapped on the rump of the lead pony and off they would drop to that road. While I stay at a breather till they came back again. Take a breather, boy. We're not working on bonus. Oh. Like it, nice as well. Oh, boy. Must up your old age, don't you? I can. Me, I just sleep. So it doesn't matter whether it's night or day to me. What time is it now? Midnight. That's midnight, I think. You must take a few minutes. Oh, yeah, about four hours, then back up, boy. What? What? I can't see anything. The lights are gone out. Oh, the TV would have done that. Don't worry. It's over here. Won't take them long. Don't get a note. Are you hearing anything? What's that? Something like singing? Something like singing? Is he singing down here? Singing like that? Something to do with that chap. I don't know what it is. Make another. It's good. That's what it is. Moves in World Cup. Get the taste of new smooth State Express three fives today. We promise you, it's the smoothest cigarette you can get. It's a blend that has been perfected after years of constant research by our master blenders. And the recent development of an entirely new process which gives you an even smoother 3-5 smoke. We promise you, it's the smoothest cigarette you can get. Smooth in world class. Get the taste of new smooth State Express 3 5 today. Yeah, the two. 
And there with me, in the field of light in the picture. And I see him. And I see him. Looking at each other. They stopped. Whoever it was, they stopped. Must have been a trick of the echo here. Must have been a rescue party trying to reach us. Why are they stopped? How's the leg? Broken, I think. Terrible pain if I try to move it. Don't move it. What? What's all going on? He stabbed me. Somebody stabbed me. In the arm. Look, blood. It's blood. It is. Happened again. Oh, for heaven's sake. They're trying to kill me. They're stabbing me with knives. Leave me alone. What are you trying to do to me? Leave me alone. Look at the blood all over the place. Somebody's cutting me to pieces. Well, it was them through it, please, Susie. Ghostland. They got fed up with us interfering or trespassing on their own place. They were making a sacrifice out of all the way. Cutting him with their own knives. Oh, terrible. Horrible. And he took a long time to die. He's gone, he was. He's gone. What can have done it? Look at the cut. The stab. I know that. Couldn't have been that anyway. Look at the wound. And you saw him, lady. He just appeared before your eyes. And if you were being stabbed with an invisible knife, we, we've got to get out of here. We've got to, you. Now, boy, how are we going to get out? We're trapped down here. There's nothing we can do. We want to the rescue fire. I'm going to find it. Not alive. We'll be dead by the time I get here. We'll all be dead. Like, like Paul and all were killed. Well, why don't we finish this off now? What are you waiting for, wherever you are? What are you waiting for? Can you get out there? Get it down, man! Please, 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 I never asked, but I, I didn't think him. What else can it be? That thing is... I never read a game like that before. I think I know what it is, boy. Remember, there's been talk on and off for years about this mine. Also, Ellen had trouble originally when he tried to think of her shop. Supposed to be the site of an old druid temple. All for the voices we heard. Ghosts of long dead druid priests. You mean me. Where we are now must have been a whole thing. I can't think of nothing else. But what about a woman? How did they die? Those I fooled, where did they come from? I think I know the answer to that thing. The blue is used to make human sacrifices. You don't mean that all in one. Yes, I do, boy. Remember the time it started? Just after midnight. What's impossible, I know, but how else do you explain it? They cut him and stabbed him until he died. They did a sacrifice of him. Unbelievable. Oh, I wouldn't believe it myself if it wasn't for my two friends, yeah? My friends, nobody can see but me. Oh, yes, it does. Oh, you don't believe me, I know. I don't blame you. Sometimes I don't believe it myself. But there you are, all right. They're smiling and nodding now. <laughs> Waiting for me for their third sacrifice, you see. Well, go on with your story. Oh, all right then. I had a feeling somehow that we were safe until midnight the next night. Something told me that this was the time when they carry out their next human sacrifice. And then the next midnight, the third one. Our only chance, please and me, was to be rescued before midnight came. My leg was bothering me bad by then, and I couldn't help much, but 
We try to dig. Come and listen to the sound of a rescue party on the other side. Oh, I pray you for you. I can't dig no more. Look at me, sir. Not get out of here, sir. A tiger at you. We've been stuck here over 20 hours. Get it on for 9 o'clock. Oh, boy. What was the show? The rescue, boy. Oh, they're working on it. Oh, I need a shovel. I'll give it. I said, no, no, no. I'll be. Fresh heart, I'll give me. I'll be. Oh, they're busy with you. Don't take love now, boy. Oh, you won't take love. But what, what is near? Will it take till past midnight? <laughs> Remember that midnight was long as I lived. If you can call this sort of existence, William, we could hear them working on the other side quite clearly by then. Rescue was very close, there was no doubt about it. But not close enough to see poor me. Came midnight, and the chanting started again. <laughs> Is that the story? They got you before another 24 hours had elapsed? No, as a matter of fact, they didn't. It was another day and a half before they got me out. But how? Why? Why didn't they kill me too? Well, by the time they got me out, I was hearing things. I must have been. Although I don't know. They told me it was my life that saved me. My life was broken, you see. And a human sacrifice had to be perfect. Had to be a perfect body to offer up. So I wouldn't do you, really. That's what the voice is doing. Well, it's a bloodthirsty story, all right. Oh, do you think it's a story, do you? I don't blame you. I wouldn't believe it myself if somebody told me. Well, anyway, you were lucky to escape the cave, weren't you? I didn't escape. They're waiting for me, you see. That's why these two are always with me. I have to be sacrificed because I have neglected the old race. And these two are your You mean the planet first, you see, I just wasted till my leg got better. Then I got the dose of the flu. Oh, 
Well, we have given them a lot of it. And then they'll give me to all. Won't you? Yes. They're not in their heads. Come, you know, I got quite used to them after all these years. I expect to be smiling when they put the knives in. That's why people think I'm mad, you see. Well, we must be getting along. Oh, well, of course. Thank you very much for the beer. Oh, thanks for telling me the story. I know you don't believe it. But it's true. Well, it looked peaceful enough, the mine. It wasn't true, was it? It couldn't have been true. No, it it couldn't, but there's one thing worries me. What's that? Well, it could have just been an old man's story to get drinks out of strangers, but... If that's all that is doing, what was that chanting that I heard when I went down the mine? I can hear it too. the taste of new smooth State Express 3.5 today. We promise you, it's the smoothest cigarette you can get. It's a blend that has been perfected after years of constant research by our master blenders. And the recent development of an entirely new process which gives you an even smoother 3.5 smoke. We promise you, it's the smoothest cigarette you can get. Smooth in world class. Get the taste of new smooth State Express 3.5 today. Today. Manufacturers of State Express 3-5 Filter King cigarettes invite you to listen next Saturday at 9 o'clock when they will again present The Creaking Door.